Hello, once again, audience, and welcome back to Dominations with Christopher. Marla will not be attacking tonight. It is just me. Lonely old me. But I've gone global. That is new. How exciting is that? I even have some globalish stuff. I've got a global war academy with nothing upgraded in it. Uh, what else are we doing? I have a global armory and not enough food to actually do anything with it. Nor can I hold enough food to do anything with it, really. Uh, so I intend on probably crowning this as soon as I do have enough food that I can do something fun with that, like maybe get some howitzers or a big fat Greek tank. But as you can imagine, Marla's very excited to have howitzers and big fat tanks at her beckoning. Um, we are in war against uh, Anzac Forces 1. Uh, they are relatively stacked. They have five little fake accounts down at the bottom here, I believe. Yeah, so they've got a medieval and four Iron Ages. So we're going to go ahead and have fun with this one. We are attacking, I believe I'm going on my mirror, which is number seven. Check it out now. And of course, what happens when I go global? I find nothing but oil. I think I'm up to like 100,000 oil, and like part of the decision to go global was, yeah. He's changed his base. That's a new base. It's a good change. It is much better than the base that I saw prior to this. He's a 170 global, so he's the same as me. Um, I think it's... Uh, the deception being that uh, university research doesn't count towards your experience level. So that's... that's. But he still say, made the same exact like fundamental flaws that he made before. And I don't know why he's done that. What fundamental flaws am I referring to? Well, he's got high hit point buildings that are all nicely bunched together and very well exposed. So, the plan is that I'm going to come in from over here. I'm coming in from over here. Uh, I'm assuming there's probably going to be a flam panzer there. That's probably why he stuck that off in the corner ever so nicely for me. We are going for the 50% quick victory. I'm going to drop a couple of fusiliers right here because he's got three nice high hit point buildings there. And a few more down here because he's got those. As well, I can take out that Colosseum, probably the Acropolis, maybe a fort. And we'll probably be close to 50. So, whoop, whoop. All right. You think so? I uh, know. I, I still think it's a design flaw. That's what I'm going with. Uh, we are going to sacrifice that and go with some extra shock infantry. Uh, and I think... Oh, I've got the wrong generals trained. And I'm missing a plane. How could I be missing a plane? You jerks. That doesn't help. We're going to go with Joan, because she's nice and big, and we'll go with, we'll take Napoleon, because he's got some decent range on him. Okay, so for troops here, I'm going three triplanes, 13 shock infantry, 25 riflemen, one heavy tank, three supply trucks, seven artillery, uh, two machine gunners. That's the one thing, the other thing that's new. I've got machine gunners. They look tough. Uh, mercenaries. I do have my little Mahout, uh, complemented with some Flaming Pancers and some Gurkhas. Uh, tactics, I've got three Elephant Armies, I'm not sure if we're going to use them. Uh, I've got my Blitzkrieg, two Betrayal, three Sabotage. I'm so happy to be back up to three Sabotage. I'm sure. Uh, and one Betrayal, or one, sorry, one Protect. Uh, Joan and Napoleon, the husband and wife couple, are joining us. Alliance troops, I've got a couple of howitzers and some little shooters. 
Whoop, whoop. Double check that we're on seven. And <gasps> we're in. So see, I'm pretty sure like See, I, I wanted that one. That's all right. Let's see here. I'm pretty sure if we get these guys all right here, we'll probably throw that protect on them. That might be helpful. Get my planes in there to help out. Those howitzers gonna get me? Did you let them out? I totally did. <laughs> Christopher. I know. Bad doobie. I don't think it's gonna happen with these troops. That was a long way to get that 50%, wasn't it? How dare you! I did get a star. That counts, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> um, but as I suspected, yeah, I'm I'm floored that that is only fifty-two percent. I really am. Like in looking at how much of that has actually been destroyed, I am shocked that that is only classified as fifty-two percent. Yeah, but a good majority of your hit points are in your town center, right? I guess, I guess And if you have a decent road true. network, it's going to be more, right? Yeah. But still, that is a good portion of his base. Like, that's... Yeah. Kill that. I saved, I saved my Blitzkrieg. I noticed. <laughs> Marla noticed. Here, let's see. We can kill that. Okay, so he does have resistance there. But, uh, Good intel to have. Yeah, yeah, I think it'll be helpful for the next person. I guess I'm not winning a cookie this time around. KL actually already won the cookie. Oh, he did. Oh, that's right, he did. King Lorenzo is the cookie winner. Or maybe we should give it to DC, I don't know. <laughs> Dark Chad. Yeah. Who, who went and, actually, no, it was DC that was the first one in there with five stars. Yes, yes. <laughs> He went and took out one of the sandbags. Yes. Well, I mean, he's enlightened aged. It's not really realistic yeah. for him to go up against uh, a global. A global. <laughs> Doesn't matter what global, but enlightened global. Yeah, not really going to happen. So. So. I think he wins a cookie. Yes. Look at that one star. Great spirit. Great spirit. Good. Good job, team. Go team. All right. So there we have it, I guess. Good game. <laughs> Go get them outlaws. Um, if you like this video, be sure to click like and subscribe down below. Last outlaws. Last, Last out outlaws. Oh, see, I, 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 I. We need a logo. We need a logo. So uh, you can look at it on the screen and be like, Last outlaws. Last outlaws. But I mean, I can see it. Yeah, I can see it in a lot of different places, but in an instance. It'll take a while. Get her done, last outlaws. 
go get your cookie. Um, <laughs> click the link down below if you like and subscribe this video, etc., etc. English, no, thank you much. Uh, sticks on the ice. Have a good time. Yeah, <laughs> there. I still got her to say it.